Green Iowa AmeriCorps members serving at the Tallgrass Prairie Center get the opportunity to work at Irvin Prairie, a 77-acre reconstruction project located near Dysart, Iowa. One of the ways in which members aid in building the center's capacity is by helping with education projects. A recent event, facilitated by member Aaron Sanderson, had high school students compare soil types by conducting an infiltration experiment. When comparing the shallow-rooted turf grass to the deep-rooted, perennial vegetation of the tallgrass prairie, it was clear the native vegetation had a larger capacity for effective infiltration. Why is this important? One factor is that infiltration can fight against excessive runoff, which can lead to erosion. Plant roots and other soil organisms improve infiltration rates by creating channels through the soil, increasing soil organic matter, and aiding the formation of soil aggregates and interconnected soil pores. Perennial roots like those of most prairie plants persist throughout the year, aiding soil infiltration during seasons when row crops are not active, such as during the early spring. Students then got an opportunity to explore the prairie, taking in the sights and sounds of Iowa's lost landscape. A big takeaway they had was how interconnected all of the different parts of the prairie ecosystem are. From the vibrant colors of flowers, to the deep roots of the grasses, to the birds nesting amongst those plants, everything has an important role to play in a healthy, vibrant landscape.